Hey everyone, this is Travis at Full Spectrum Laser. Today I have a Muse in front of me with a bad power supply. So today I'm going to show you how to replace it. First thing, we're going to remove the panel from the right side of the Muse. You'll notice that there are four screws that hold it into place. So we're just going to remove those and it should come right off. You'll notice that there are four screws holding this power supply in place. After we have removed those four screws, we are going to uncouple the quick disconnect by unscrewing it like this. After you've removed the screws that hold the power supply in place, you're going to just slowly lower it down. And then there are three plugs on the inside that will need to be removed. So first we're going to remove the top, then we'll remove the middle, and then the bottom one. All right, so we're going to push these plugs out of the way and we're going to slowly slide the power supply out of its housing. Just make sure you don't pull any other cables or ruin anything in the process. On top of it, you will notice that there is a grounding cable. We're going to want to unscrew that and remove that cable. And from here, we're just going to slowly pull the whole thing out. And there it is. There's the power supply. So you notice in the back corner, you'll see a hole that we're going to feed the quick disconnect from your new power supply through first. From here, we're going to connect the ground to the new power supply. Make sure it's firmly seated so it will properly ground. All right, then just reinsert it carefully so we don't catch any of the other cables. And then make sure you plug the proper cables back into the correct spots. You have your four pin, your five pin, and your three pin. And now we are just going to remount the power supply. All right, and the last thing we're going to do is plug the tube back in. And then make sure to tuck that back out of the way so it doesn't get in the way of your gantry. See, that wasn't so bad. If you're still having issues, though, feel free to reach out to our support team at any time. Also, like and subscribe for more content.